What's up, YouTube? Back at it again for your midweek review on some coupon deals. Make sure I'm straight. I'm on my way to work, leaving 7-Eleven because I got to get that coffee. That's like my drug, but I'm just getting black coffee, no cappuccino no more, laying off that, man. So anyway, we're going to bang out. But the first thing I want to do um, before we get started, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you... um. You know, hit that like button, drop a comment if any questions you got on these coupons or any questions in the world. I don't really care. I'm going to answer you, all right? But anyway, I want to get into it with the deals. But before we do that, we got to talk about it. Now, last video, if you checked out the last video, I was talking about um, coupon tips, okay? Um, I'm going to be looking and riding and driving, all right? Don't worry. I promise I'll be safe. But anyway, we're going to talk about what happened with this lady. They called the cops on her. Because she tried to use a coupon. Didn't make no sense. It really didn't. It didn't make any sense at all. And um, it sucks, man, what happened. I'm going to post up some pictures. I'm not going to post up the video. I don't really like to expose people like that. This lady was standing there looking helpless, crying. Damn cops searching her, male cops searching her and everything. And it's just, it's, it's, it's sad, man, because she wanted to use a coupon. And I don't know what, I don't know what happened. But anyway... The tip I gave you guys is how we kill it with kindness. When they uh, decline you of your coupons and say, no, we don't accept these, no, we can't use them, it's better just to move on because the way things are today, man, you don't know what's going to happen. It's better just to move on and say, okay, I'll just try again later. I'll try another scenario or I'll just go to another store establishment or whatever. This lady supposedly went in wanting to use a coupon and um, they denied her. And I don't know what happened inside the store, but they had about five or six cops, maybe four or five, I'm not sure. But they had a gang of cops out there, too many for one lady trying to use a coupon. Now, my, my thing is, what happened inside the store? To me, it don't matter what happened inside the store unless she pulled out a gun, okay? If she made threats, and if you look at it, watching the whole video, I'll probably post it up, I don't know. I just don't want to expose the lady because it's sad. I don't want to put her face on camera. But I'll put something up. But anyway, for them to call cops and those other cops, I'm going to just say they had nothing else to do. So they wanted to show up and see what's cracking. I don't know. They got the male cop searching the lady. She's yelling she's pregnant. When you got the female cop right there, female cops should be searching her, not the male cop. Come on. Let's give a little respect, people. Now, I, hey. I like cops. I got nothing against them. They don't. I, they know me out here, Riverside, uh, because of things I used to do, legal stuff, legal stuff. Um, so they just know me. But anyway, that was wrong what they did. I feel. You drop a comment. Let me know if you guys seen the video. Let me do, tell me how you feel about it. Is it right? Is it wrong? What did she do? I mean, she wanted to use a coupon. They denied her. I don't know if she called for the manager. I don't know if she yelled. I don't know if she cussed. It, regardless of that, really, all those cops, come on now. It don't take that many cops to come through over a coupon. If she pulled out a gun, okay, I can see why. I can see. You pulled out a gun, and we got an issue, okay? I understand. Man, but they searched her. She's yelling. She's pregnant. This guy's, like, all behind her, just all up on her, dude. And I'm just like, you got to be kidding me, man. I'd be, man, if that was my wife, dude, I'd be pissed off. Somebody going to catch a lawsuit. Target, look. Seriously, it's a reason why I don't shop there no more because of situations like this. And I've been in bad situations to where I got angry to where this girl, this this little kid yelled at me, okay? She yelled at me because I used my coupons in a self-checkout because the lines are too long in the line. She straight up yelled at me. And I had to like bite my tongue and catch my breath because this girl was about to get knocked. I ain't gonna say it. She was about to get told something. So I ignored it. I told the manager, I said, listen, I don't appreciate her talking to me like that. Now, here's my story real quick. Don't appreciate you talking to me like that. Can you please talk with her? I am not a kid. And the way she came at me was inappropriate. You know, told her everything. Lady apologized to me. I'm going to have a talk with her, blah, blah, blah. Boom. Check this out. Why I go back to that same target a few weeks later, I go to the self-checkout. And this girl yells at me again. Wow. I'm not even gonna tell you what I did, but I man, I, I man, put it like this: you, people saw a different side of me. 
because I went off on a little girl. You know what I'm saying? I was I was talking to her like she was a crackhead on the reels. But that's me. But anyway. But anyway. But like I said, I'm really disturbed by it. Target, y'all need to catch a lawsuit. You need to retrain your employees. You got to do something. It's sad how you treated this lady. It's not right. I'm pretty sure the lady buys other stuff and probably don't even use coupons. I mean, I go into establishment and I use a coupon, but it's something else I might need that don't need a coupon or, and I just buy it. So you making money off of me. So don't, don't trip, right? But this lady, man, they had her up there in front of everybody, man. She's crying and everything, sitting there. It's like she was, she was just like, she couldn't do nothing, man. Cops all on. And I'm going to tell you something. It couldn't have been bad because I don't, I didn't recall any tickets given. They didn't, I mean, come on, dude. She didn't do anything wrong. That's all I'm saying. She didn't do nothing wrong, man. And it's, it's sad. Um, unfortunately, you know, you got to, where a lot of people are afraid of cops because you don't know what they're going to do because cops are scared that they don't know what you're going to do. So I, in, a, in a sense, I understand. You know what I'm saying? You can be afraid of a cop and a cop can be afraid of you. There's cops out here losing their lives. And I ain't the one to try to like say, hey, man, that's your fault. Nah. That's how the world is. And unfortunately, we live in it. You know what I'm saying? If I can move to Mars, I'll go right now. But I can't. But anyway, I'm just saying, though, man, I just felt like they handled it in the wrong way. They, it could have been a better way. They could have set the lady down. The lady cop could have stood in and say, look, guys, let me talk to her. You know, it's certain. It's so many ways you can do things to make it a better way. You know what I'm saying? To, to make it a better ending. I don't know, man. I mean, it's really disturbing. But anyway... Um, let's get into these deals because I don't want to make the video too long and everything. It's a mid week review. I feel sorry for the lady, man. It's really disturbing. Makes me want to go in Target and just throw all my coupons on the floor. But that's just being ridiculous. I ain't going to do that because I need my coupons. Anyway, so look, let's get into the deals right now. Uh, drop a comment if you got something to say about it. We can talk about it again and go from there. It's disturbing. If you haven't seen the video, um, I'm going to see if I can post a link down below so you can catch the video. I'll post up some pictures and go from there. But here are the videos for this week. I mean, <laughs> here are the coupon deals for this week, man. It's a lot of good ones and everything. So I hope you still got your coupons valid. Make sure they cut out. We're just going to go from there. And other than that, I'm going to just be posting them up. And um, again, it's disturbing. Target, shame on you, man. Who called the police? What did you say on the phone to the police to bring that many cops out? I mean, they was coming out like somebody was fighting or somebody made threats. You know what I'm saying? It's ridiculous. What did they say? You know, it's a, it's a damn shame, but, you know, we got to figure something out. You know, we got to figure it out. And I don't want nobody to get in, I mean, you know, hey, I'm not going to coupon no more because of situations like this. Nah, you just like go in there. If they say no, just walk out. Don't worry about it. You know what I'm saying? It's they lost. You know what I'm saying? Because they get paid off the coupons that we use, you know? They get paid off that. They don't, and the employees don't realize that. And sometimes management don't realize that. You know what I'm saying? I'm backing in right now to this beautiful job I go to every day. But anyway, oh, they gave me a raise too. Yeah. They got me for one more year. But anyway, um, I don't get it. I don't understand it. When you use a coupon, they send it off to the manufacturing company. The item's right. Everything matches up. The store gets paid. What's the big deal? You know what I'm saying? You getting paid. I mean, if I own the store and I took coupons and I know there's a deal out, because I know they know, everyone knows ahead of time, there's a deal coming out. That's why they put the coupons out and that's why they have sales. So in a sense, you look at it, you come to my store using coupons, as long as everything match, guess what? I'm going to make sure I'm fully stocked. If we got to do a hundred different transactions, bring it. Because guess what? I'm going to get paid and I'm going to keep on restocking. That's just how you do business. That's how I see it. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, look, we're going to get out of here. Posted up the deals. I feel so terrible about the lady again, man, because it's not right how she was treated. Um, being pregnant and all. Lady cop right there. Guy cop searching her. It was just, you know, four or five cops standing around like she getting ready to like blast on everybody. Come on, man. That's scary. And she had to be scared because you don't know. Some cops are trigger happy. You know, they, she could be reaching her purse for a phone and they all pull out a gun and start shooting. You don't know what could have happened because it happens. That's the bad part. But anyway, I'm going to get on. Stop rambling on. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Share this video, man. Every week I'm posting up coupon deals. I'm doing coupon books review to let you know what's coming out. I uh, appreciate your support. Make sure we get 200 subscribers so I can give out a bunch of coupon books. And uh, we're just going to go from there. All right? Peace.